with the foes in the most. Hey guys, we're back, and today we have a very special video for you. It's a special seed showcase, and um, we'll show you why it's so special in a minute. So, yeah. yeah. We're just like, um, we're in a random seed that we've generated the like uh, link or the seed of which will be in the description. Uh, and when you first spawn, there's like three connecting biomes. There's a swamp, a uh, regular forest, and a desert biome that are all interjoining. And there's a mob village nearby, which is where we were. Yeah, and even more than that, we're going to show you what's so special about it. So if you follow me through the swamp, and yeah. just over here. So in single player, like not in multiplayer, because the spawns are a bit messed up. But you'll spawn around here in single player. So if you come over here, yeah, in fact, I'll put up the coordinates on the screen now. So the coordinates for this are uh, x two two four y eight two, and uh, well, no, y doesn't matter, but um, then z is one three five. Okay, so you'll notice these three massive holes in the ground. Yeah, and um, if you go into the first one over here on the right. You can actually see all the way down to diamond level, and we'll show you that. So if you come down here, massive hole, and it leads onto this awesome ravine, and mine shaft. Yeah, there's a mine shaft inside it as well. Yeah. So if you come down here, let's just place a few torches. Um, it's very nice. And then down here, voila, diamond. Diamonds and lapis and iron and coal yeah. and your usual ravine stuff. Yeah, just look up, like. From ground level to diamond level. So good. Yeah, it's very good. Um, there's another few holes that also spawn. Um, in multiplayer, uh, these holes just spawn randomly, but sometimes they don't actually appear in single player, but if you dig down, then you'll find the same features. Okay, so if we jump into the second hole, um, pretty much the same, just not a, attached to a ravine. More mine another and... Like yeah, there's some mine shafts here. Yeah, it just leads into some pretty awesome caves. Um, this is probably the least interesting of the three awesome holes. holes. <laughs> um, Hang on. And a bit dodgy. Yeah. Um, I'm just thinking, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, okay, so now we've come into the last hole, which is, like, really cool. Because, as you'll notice on the first bit down, there's this dungeon just hanging out in the wall here. So yeah. Through. The Casual spawner. Oh crap! Yeah, just, I just broke the spawner, but that's good. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, so this is a um, yeah zombie mob spawner casually in the wall of the ravine. Why won't he die? I don't know. Maybe because he's invincible. Um, yeah, and then outside there's a another ravine. It's just absolutely huge. Uh, again, there's an interconnecting mine shaft. Yep. And, um, if we go down here, um, it's down here, I think, actually, no, um, oh yeah, it's down here, follow me. Okay. So if you come down here, turn the corner here, and guess what, there's another one of. Oh my gosh. Another dungeon. This they time were, and this time it's a, yeah, skeleton. So there's some, like, all the chests in both dungeons are covered by gravel, but you can dig them and find out what's in them for yourself. Yeah. Um, let's get out of here. Let's go back into the... Oh. Ah, right, creeper. <laughs> um, if you come in here, there's another part of an awesome cave. Oh, whoops. Yeah, that's pretty nice. Down to here. But... There is one really special part of the cave that we would like to show you. But I... Yeah, there is. Do you wanna... We keep on going. Do you want to go there? Yeah. I... Where is it? I can't remember. But um, 
it's, it's really cool, but... Well, basically, it's a quad ravine. There's four ravines, like, interlocking with each other. Yeah, there's like, there's like two massive ones right next to each other, and then at either end there's a huge ravine. Um, hang on. I believe, can't you get to it through the second hop? Okay, so now we've found the quad ravine, if you follow me down here. Um, just a little small hole in the first ravine. You fly through here, well, not if you're on, not on creative, but I suggest you are, because there's a lot of lava. And you'll yeah, there is. This room here. Now this is a ravine. <laughs> <laughs> As you can see, there's loads of like walls that are half broken and awesome cave systems. And if you just go through here, see the Enderman. Um, it's just like there is the yeah yeah down this side of the um, ravine. It kind of splits into two, and there's a second ravine which has spawned kind of in the same place. So it makes it like two ravines and then look and then you can look through here so there's one ravine two ravine three ravine Th this is a third ravine that also interconnects wow and then it bends all the way around here it's just amazing isn't it yeah it's so cool and then is there more got... down the end of here pretty much yeah, no, um, down the end, if I go back down this way, look, there's another ravine down here. So it's quite, it's absolutely huge. Yeah, I definitely suggest that you guys try this out. Yeah, because, I mean, you've got everything in the cave system, like, all kind of joint in. So it's, it's, very, it's a very nice seed. Yeah. Well, I think that probably wraps up our seed showcase. Seed yeah, so uh, again, see the seed in the um, description, and please like, favourite, and to subscribe to us, Kodo123 and Chaotic Nation, if you enjoyed this video.